Hey everyone! In the last video about the ornithopter, I wasn't able to get the wings flapping. Now I've got the crankshaft all set up so the wings can flap. One of the changes I made was I added a section for the wings to nest into. This gives my paper clips enough space to move around each other. Getting the wings to flap took lots of trial and error. One of the things I found to be helpful was setting the ornithopter on its wings like this allowed me to test out different size levers. So if one lever was too long or too short, the wings wouldn't sit flat on the table. And once I was able to get the wings to sit flat on the table, I knew I had the right size levers coming off the crankshaft. Something that helped me out this time was hot gluing the ends of the paper clips to stop the ornithopter from falling apart. I use rubber bands to power the ornithopter. I'll put on multiple rubber bands to increase the tension, giving it more power. This is just a test to see how it falls. Now I'm going to crank it up and see if we get some kind of linear motion. The flying didn't go well at all. Overall, this design is pretty bulky, and I need to do whatever I can to reduce the mass. The ornithopter was gliding better when the wings weren't even flapping. I'm going to add a tail to help create this stability, so while the ornithopter's wings are flapping, the tail can help provide the stability it needs to stay in the air. Overall, there is lots of improvement that this ornithopter is going to need before it will actually fly. Like and subscribe if you want to stay up to date on this project. See you later.